Carrot Legal Workflows leverage the already powerful legal calendaring and task management capabilities. This allows you to facilitate the automated creation of events and tasks assigned to staff across the firm. Organized by practice area, these reusable workflow templates help increase the efficiency, improve accuracy, as well as ensure uniformity across the firm. With the easy to use workflow canvas editor, it allows you the simplicity of dragging and dropping, which allows the firm to quickly build and manage their own workflows. Now let's jump into the creation of a workflow. You can see here with the canvas editor within the firm settings, this is where you can once again create a workflow based off of a particular practice area. And once that template is created, it can be used as many times moving forward. Now in this instance, I'm creating a workflow for the steps needed to set up a deposition. As you can see here within the workflow, what you're going to be doing is setting up an anchor date, uh, an anchor event or task that's essentially going to kick off your particular workflow. In this instance, you're going to see that this particular task is to call the client to rehash the dates for the deposition. For each task or event in which you're creating within a workflow, you can assign a, a responsible role that will allow this task to be automatically assigned to. Now, in this instance, upon creating the anchor event, I've created several other tasks that are dependent on the preceding task at hand. And so if we go to draft the notice of examination, as you can see here, the next task, if I click edit, you'll see once again, the subject, the assigned role. But what's most important is that the drafting notice of the examination does not kick off until the initial task has been completed. And so once again, automating each step within this process and ensuring a step is completed before the user can move forward. Now, when it comes to workflows, they do not just have to be linear. They, you have the ability to run a parallel workflow in conjunction with the initial workflow. And so as you're seeing here, I could certainly run a parallel workflow task in alignment with any of these dependent events essentially allowing you to create a multi-sig workflow. Now, how are these workflows applied? If I jump over to a matter, as you can see here on this particular screen, to the right of task, you'll now have the workflows tab. And to apply a workflow, I'd simply just click the plus sign here. Upon clicking the plus sign, you have the ability to once again, choose the corresponding workflow based off the practice area. Now, because this is a civil litigation case, you're going to see it's populating the setup deposition workflow. If I simply just click the play button, I then have the ability once again to choose the appropriate anchor date in which all the preceding tasks will be created off of. And then once again, I can indicate who this particular set of tasks are going to be assigned to. Now, in this instance, if I choose that individual and I click save, what you're going to see here now is it's created that particular workflow and it's identified within the status bar the four steps and the progress of that workflow. Now, if we jump over to task, what you're going to see is the automated creation of that initial task. Now, like I previously indicated, upon the completion of this task, and so in this instance, I'm going to mark this one complete. You're going to see it's now going to be moved from the in progress to the completed section. If I go over to workflows, what you're now going to see is you're going to see that the workflow um, has the workflow stat progress has been updated. And if we go back over to drafting of uh, if we go back over to task, you'll now see a new workflow. Once again, the draft notice of examination. And so once again, the dependency of each task in order to be created is the completion of the previous task. But what's most important is that within the workflow section, you have a real in real time progress bar indicating where that workflow stands. And within Carrot Legal, you can allocate as many workflows to a particular matter to once again automate the creation of task or calendar events within Carrot Legal. Thank you.